if you think about, uh, I don't know, some traditional software and, and developers choosing software for their applications, let's say you have databases, if, if only we had only one database flavor, right? We had MySQL and you could just use MySQL, everybody would be just using MySQL. But today what we have, we have like MySQL and not only MySQL, but PostgreSQL, and which is kind of same flavor of, of relational databases, but um, but they, there are plenty of differences and you have non-relational databases, et cetera. So for developers each time, uh, they basically build a solution, they need to uh, go through this path of choosing the right stack and choosing the right tools, right? So in, in the same way it's developing, I think in, in the blockchain space. So we have different tools for different needs um, and they have different value proposition. All right. In the same way as you have like relational databases and, and non-relational databases, they have totally different value proposition. They are focused on totally different things. Uh, so in the same way, I think all this all these protocols work in a way. So obviously, it became more complicated for developers uh, uh, to decide. Uh, 